wanted to know what, what you're demoing here in terms of safe of course, driving initiative. Yeah, certainly. Yeah. So my division is chassis controls within Bosch. Yeah. And our objective is safe and comfortable driving. Oh, okay. We, our long-term vision is to have fatality free leading to collision free driving. Yeah. And for that reason, if you can point to that uh, monitor, we're here. showing the automated driving vehicle. And uh, uh, what we show here yeah. is also on this touch screen is a series of functions yeah. that lead us, that are stepping stones towards automated driving vehicles. As you can see, some of these functions are already available on mm -hmm. existing vehicles. And uh, behind you is a list of all the functions and when these are have been or are, are going to be released. An interesting function would be something like the integrated cruise assist. Yeah. This is going to be probably the first foray into automated driving in the highway conditions. As you slide down the road, here is a vehicle that uses cameras to center your vehicle in the lane. Mm -hmm. And it also has a radar system that uh, gauges its distance between the leading car and itself to make sure that it always follows the vehicle at a, in a safe, uh, within a safe distance. Yeah. So in case this vehicle reduces its speed, your vehicle will automatically slow down. Because that is currently like one of the most annoying things about driving with cruise control is the fact that no one else does or seems to. Correct. And the variable speed, it's, it's very aggravating, right? Correct, yeah. correct. And, and unsafe. Also. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. So, uh, so the benefit, I'll give you a short demo of how it works, mm -hmm. is that the lane keeping system makes sure that the uh, vehicle stays within the lane and as you encounter curves in the road or bends in the road, the vehicle steers itself automatically mm -hmm. uh, in the automated mode. And, and it's using the, the, the lead car no, to do that? No, it's using the camera that's on oh, the vehicle okay. to detect the lane markings yeah. and keep itself centered at all, the at all times. Wow. The interesting thing is we have a concept vehicle that we are demonstrating to customers and people. Mm -hmm. We had it here last year. Uh, we also have the capability that if you see a situation where uh, we have systems in the, in the radars on the car that look in the back of the car to make sure that uh, it is safe to pass. And if it sees a situation when you can do a safe par passing maneuver. So if it, it will, detects that you're always going under your preferred speed, it'll actually pass? Correct. It'll, it'll give you the option of passing. Uh -huh. And if you click on the indicator button, yeah. you know, the indicator light, it will do the safe passing maneuver as well. Wow. So, you know, it makes it, it makes driving more convenient, yeah. definitely makes it safer and it is going to be probably something that is more realistic in terms of automated driving in the near future. That's what I was going to say, because like Google is demoing like fully automated self-driving cars, right? But uh, it's probably going to be a gray area between full manual and full automatic Absolutely, and absolutely. And I would like to point out that we also have an automated driving car, and you can see the video of it here. Yeah. And we have two such vehicles, one that's running in North America and one that's in Europe. Mm -hmm. So, you know, people know about Google, but I think we gotta keep, a, 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 we've got to point out that Bosch also has, and here is a picture of it. Yeah. So we have an automated driving vehicle as well. And is this, uh, like this technology here, how long before this is in shipping cars? Actually, I think that's a very good point. If you look at all the functions here, mm -hmm. with the exception of the integrated cruise assist, the rest of the functions are available uh, to our customers. And if you look at the, uh, the, the wall Time here, line. 2014 is, where, is when we are going to have the predictive pedestrian protection available. Mm -hmm. 2014 is when we will also have the traffic jam assist and 2015 the automatic park assist. Great. So accepting this integrated cruise assist that I showed you. So that's a bit further out? Exactly, yes. Great, and, and you have uh, all kinds of OEM partners like GM, like all the big guys, or can you can you list them? Or? We actually have a couple of customers that are definitely using these, for instance, uh, we can talk about Audi and uh, Volkswagen. Okay, great. And uh, we also have, uh, for instance, crash avoidance systems that you see, we have uh, that available on Chrysler's right now. Yeah. So we have got customers in the region, for sure. Great, all right, thanks very much. You're welcome, thank you for stopping by. Take care.